hi everybody if you subscribe to my channel I will subscribe back um yeah if, if you subscribe to me I will subscribe back to you uh just I'm just letting you know so if you if you want to talk uh message me you uh, you're welcome to um <laughs> so yeah um I'm just doing an update uh so yeah, if you describe to me, I would describe back, so, uh, I'm just letting you know that I would do it back. Just send me a message on my, under my videos, and saying that subscribe back to me, and I will. Uh, so, describe to me, and I will subscribe to you. So, okay? And... Thanks if you subscribe to my channel, and if you don't, then it's a, it's okay, it's up to you. But if you subscribe to me, I will subscribe back. That's how I am. Um. So yeah. Yeah. Love yourself. Be who, be who you are, and don't change it for the world. So. I'm just weird, and I like being weird. <laughs> so I just do videos of my animals or random animals too. And if you have a, if you have uh, videos of animals that you want me to submit on my channel, you're welcome to just email me or message me on Facebook. Uh, my Facebook link is uh, it's on my face, uh, it's on YouTube. So yeah, if you want me to do that, don't worry. I will put your uh, uh, your channel's name under underneath it and tell them about your pet and whatever you want me to tell them okay so yeah if you want me to do that just let me know and I will do it uh, so I, I just love I just love taking videos of animals I love everything like that I don't know why I just love animals <laughs> I mostly love cats because cats are much more fun uh, they're like a gifted like some of them is unique, some of them smart, um, I don't know, some of mine are smart, like, uh, I have a big cat called Big Pop, he knows how to use a toilet, mind you, he, I can't film it because, uh, he gets really mad, uh, uh, I have, uh, my mom has a cat named Pat Jr., you talk to him and he talks back and he nags and nags and nags, uh, my mom even has another cat, uh, Ladybug, uh, whole Ladybug, um, She's an, a neat freak. She likes to be clean, and if you, um, if you touch her, you have to wash your hands. So, yeah, um, she's, like, weird, and she's the one master cat. She loves my mom the most. Uh, I have a ladybug, too, but she's, she's kind of weird, but it's kind of funny. And I have Kiki. He has, like, Down syndrome. I, somebody told me that. But, hey, every cat. If, uh, I don't know, any cat that has, like, any problems, I don't really care about an animal, the way they look, the, the way they uh, act. I just love them because they're cats or they're animal, and you can't be picky with the color. If you do, then it's very hard because, uh, if you get an animal, and you have to get the animal to get to know you better or let the animal pick you out, if the animal don't pick you out, then it's gonna be hard to have a hard bond with your animal and a hard bond with uh, stuff like that your uh, your animal would not uh, be loyal to you and your animal won't like you so all my animals pick me out um, so yeah I like Bella I my cat Bella the one that's on my profile like on my thing I raised her as a baby because she supposed to die she supposed to put, put down because of her water in her lungs she couldn't digest the water, so I bottle fed her, I looked after her, and now she's one of my babies. Even I got a tattoo of her because she's, she love, uh, she's, I, I can't be here today without her, so she's like my number one baby, and I love her. I love her to this day. Um, so yeah, uh, and my other cat's, uh, a Winnie Bug. Winnie Bug's the mom, but Winnie Bug is like, big love bug she's like a mother figure to everyone and Bella is like Winnie's the mother of Bella and some of the other cats that I have and Big Pop is 
one of, uh, a couple of the fathers too, but the only ones that not the kids it's Kiki and Lady, my Kiki and my Lady. Um, so yeah, um, but yeah, if you wanted to do that, even I have a build of dragon called Iggy. Um, the only way I picked out Iggy is because I love Iggy Azalea. I don't know why, but I, I like her. She's cool. Um, but yeah, Iggy, I like the word Iggy. I don't know why. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, my build of dragon picked me up too. Um, I didn't have the thought. Like, I got scared of lizards, and I didn't like them. I got paranoid with them. But she picked me up, she jumped on top of me out on the pet store and when she was a baby and I kind of fell in love with her and to this day she never bit me. I even when I try to feed her she won't take it out of my hand because she was scared to, that she's going to bite me. And I don't know why but she's respectable too and you can't get a, uh, you can't get a pet that's like a lot of respect to you because when I put my uh, bearded dragon on my uh, bed she jumps out and she shit on a piece of newspaper on the floor or a piece of paper and she shits on the paper and she won't chew on my um, my cords so I don't know I guess I got lucky with her and I love her she's uh, she's a big part of my family now and I don't know I just I, I have, I'm addicted to animals I don't know why <laughs> But I do. Mostly cats. I don't know why, but I grew up with cats. I grew up with dogs. Um, but yeah, I mostly love cats. I don't know why, but the way the cats act and the way the cats poses and the, and the cat's eyes, I don't know why. But I really love the way cats look. Because the, um, the structure of a cat or the breeds of the cats or anything like that. I just, I just know cats and I love it. And... It's really weird. That's the only thing that I'm, addic I'm addicted to is like cats. I love my cats. And I love some dogs. I like uh, Pomeranian. I like that. Corley. I like that. Um, a Husky. Oh, uh, Snow Dog. I like them. Uh, I like any kind of dogs. But I get, I got, I get kind of paranoid because when I was... Uh, I think seven or eight. I got attacked by a dog. It just randomly came up and bit my side. So, uh, I just had a bad experiment with a, a dog. It just, I tried to have a dog, a puppy. Um, I don't know. I, don't, I didn't have the patience for it. But some dogs I like. Um, but so, like, it's very hard to raise a puppy as a baby because it's, it's like raising a kid and you have to. Uh, like take it for walks and just like change the di diapers and all that stuff but after a while it's they'll love you more and all that stuff I just I love cats because they're much more independent um, they come up to you when they feel like it uh, and they like uh, sometimes they like to be by themselves and they don't bug me half the time and I love cats um, Fish, I like fish too. It's not that bad. I had a couple of fish. Um, my favorite fish that I won't get but I love is a piranha. I don't know why, but I like the way they look. Um, at first, I thought they were like miniature sharks, uh, but I don't know. It's just like to me, I think a shark and a fish come uh, together into one. And I like I love piranhas, but I was too too scared to have one. I love piranhas. Um, uh, <laughs> snakes? I don't like snakes. Like, I got really paranoid with round snakes. I don't know why, but it just... Snakes? No. But lizards? I'm okay with. Um, I always wanted a chameleon, but they take a lot... Uh, they need a lot of t attention. Like, I mean a lot of attention. Um, I just like them because they they go onto the thing and, like, they can take their, uh, uh and, bre like, um, camouflage to anything they, they go on. And I thought that was neat. And it's very hard to find them, too. And I, I just love the way they look. Um, I think... After Iggy passed away or Iggy thing like that, I might get another one. I don't know yet, but I, I won't get another one if I have an, one because I don't know. It just 
I have like five cats and one bearded dragon. I think that's plenty enough. But if I live in a bigger place, then yes, I would. Um, I would turn my whole house into a pen zoo because I love animals. I don't know why. I just I don't like them being uh, abused or mistreated. I hate that. That really pisses me off when people take animals and they just abuse it because it's for something to do. And to be honest with you, it's very stupid. It's it's ridiculous too. Why would you even put an animal through that? To me, I think people who's who uh, got a criminal record, oh, bad with the uh, the main society, should not have animals because they they shouldn't. And uh, it's just like when you take an animal, it's just like having a kid. Now tell me, in in the long term, would you give away your animal, or would you give away your baby? Now. I was raised, what, when you adopt an animal, or you raise an animal, you're with the animal thick and thaw, a thick and till the end, like when they pass away, you don't give them out. Even if they have uh, problems or uh, stuff like that you can't afford, it's many places that would help you out, or you, you could try different places and they would help you out. Don't get rid of your animal for stupid things. And they said a lot of things about uh, if you have a baby and uh, cats are not good with kids. Uh, that's a wrong because when I was a baby, I had an I had a lot of cats and the cats was great. Um, it just female cats are much more good with the kid. It's because uh, they're like a mother figure and they would help the cat uh, help the kid out. Um, but yeah, uh, it's number one uh, pet that I have. I I will recommend if you have a kid is a female cat, um, the one that had kittens and was a great mother. Then yes, they would be uh, number one protective over your kid. Um, anybody who tries to go around your kid, they would attack it and all like that. Um, so I I watch a lot of uh, YouTube uh, channels um, about pets and. Um, the way they look after the, the uh, uh, look after babies, like some dogs, like some pit bulls, uh, good with kids, but it's the way you raise an animal too. Um, if you raise it as a baby, then yes, it's gonna be a love bug, and it's the way you raise it. But if you just beat it up or abuse it, the animal thinks that uh, it's okay to get beat up people or bite them or stuff like that. Um, no, it's not. Um, but like my Billy Dragon, um, she's very protective over me. I love her. Um, uh, when somebody slaps me or anything like that, she gets really offended and she be, uh, she really hisses. Like just like my my cats. Um, anyone have tried to abuse me, they stuck in their neck and like attack them. Um, like uh, like Bella. Um, if I have friends over, she has to check them out before she pass. Um, it's just because she's very protective of me and she didn't want me to get hurt or don't want me to have the bad uh, bad person over here or anything like that. It just is if you raise an animal to a kid until now and it's like for an adult, the the uh, pet would be promoted to you and protective over you and very protective over you. Um but they'll they're great to have. Um they're good Pan, uh, panionships, <laughs> um, they're better than, uh, people, like, when you date people, you know how they, like, cheat on you, or, uh, bring home, stuff like that, a cat would be, uh, love you for who you are, and never change you, or, even if you're fat, or ugly looking, how people say it, um, a cat would never turn you down, or an animal will not turn you down, anything, um, but I don't, I don't think anyone's ugly, it's just, everybody's cute in their own way, um, everybody has their own thing, um, but yeah, the only thing I hate is people like, oh, you have to be a certain way or something like that, that's bullshit, to me, I think it is, because it's not the way you look, it's the way your, it's the way your personality is, um, I'm, 
I have a lot of free, uh, a lot of female friends because they're much more understandable than guys. Um, like I have one friend, Sabrina. She's awesome. She's a painter. Um, uh, even she sells her artwork. Um, if you do want uh, her email, I can link her email at the bottom. Um, and you can contact her and just uh, tell her that you checked out uh, Jazz uh, channel and you saw her email address. But um, yeah, you should check her out. Uh, she, if you tell her what you want, uh, she will paint it. She's much more of her own way paint. Um, I like her paintings uh, yeah, because it's unique. Um, I don't know. It's, it just brings out her personality, and I think that's I think that's awesome to have a uh, have something that you love in life, and you do it. Like me, I love taking videos of animals, pictures of animals. Um, it's really fascinating to me. I don't know why. <laughs> like Bella, um, I just take a camera and I just randomly take pictures of her. She like poses and. It's so cute. I don't know why. I like the way she poses. But yeah, um, if you subscribe to me, I'll subscribe back. Um, if you want me to do uh, videos of yours, uh, just give me the video. Uh, like, do a video and send it to me on Messenger or anything like that, and I will put your video on it. Uh, even your channel at the bottom, if you want. Um, and tell me what's, what you want me to put on the title, the name of the pet, or anything like that. Um, I'll be happy to do that if you want me to. Um, just, just, if you subscribe to me, I subscribe back. Just, just send me a message on my, one of my videos saying that, can you please subscribe me back as I subscribe to you. Then I'd be happy to subscribe back to you. Um, because I... I love everyone. <laughs> I'm not a mean person. I, I, I'm very shy um, at first, but my mom got me out of that, and some of my friends got me out of that. So I start doing this because I'm gonna do, and I love talking about videos. So uh, about pets and animals. Sorry, um, but yeah, do that thing I told you if you want. Uh, I'd be happy to. Uh, okay, be yourself. Uh, don't change anything, love who you are, and, and peace and love. Bye.